Well, if you're wanting to go see a movie, maybe Sunday is the day for that. Yeah. And if you don't feel like ringing in the New Year at home, there are plenty of local events to get you out on New Year's Eve, and one of the largest of those is making a comeback. Yeah, they call it Last Night on the Town. It's back in Virginia Beach, and our Anthony Sabella is live in Town Center this morning, checking out what they have planned. Anthony, good morning. Hey, good morning. And yeah, they already have the street closed off here. We've got some crews out here very early this morning setting up the stage for last night on the town, which will be right there in the middle of Columbus Street. This is where this event will ring in 2022 tomorrow night. And we actually came out yesterday to check out the setup too, and, and crews were already out there putting up the VIP section of the event. I'm told it'll have a great view of the stage that'll feature 90s band Whoa, and then local favorite, the DeLoreans, taking us to midnight and the beach ball drop. Now this is a return for one of the region's largest New Year's celebrations after last year's was canceled due to COVID. Last night on the town is free and open to the public every year and it shuts down the streets as I mentioned and in the past it's drawn thousands of people here to town center. Now knowing that the rise of the COVID-19 Omicron variant and the fact that Virginia broke the record for single day new cases yesterday has not gone unnoticed among or organizers. We're very concerned and we want people to have a good time. We don't want there to be um, any issues. But again, because it's an outdoor event and because there is room for people to spread out, we felt comfortable moving forward this year. And so they will do so starting at six o'clock tomorrow night with dancing and other entertainment at the uh, town center central fountain. And then they'll move to the stage and all of the music and the real New Year's festivities starting around nine o'clock tomorrow night. Um, again, there are still VIP tickets available, I'm told, and there is a lot of setup to do here on Columbus Street. Uh, one thing I talked to the organizers about was the impact this has on local businesses right here in the town center area. We're going to get into that when you make the switch to WGNT. As for which events are still going on for New Year's, which events are canceled, you can get that information on our website, WTKR.com. Reporting live here in Virginia Beach, Anthony Sabella, News